authorities say they've recovered the body of a man who went missing Friday night in Santa Rosa Sound. And now we know who that man was, a prominent executive for a local hospital. Fox 2 News reporter Corey Pippin has details on the victim and will lead to the accident and recovery mission. Officials say the search started Friday for a man who went missing in the Santa Rosa Sound near the Portofino condominiums. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission, as well as the Scambia County Search and Rescue, combed the waters for nearly two days. Well, I had seen some boats in the water with some flashing lights. Um, Saturday night, they were red and yellow lights. and wasn't sure what was going on. Today, crews recovered a body. Officials with Baptist Healthcare say the victim is Chief Financial Officer Carrie Vermillion, who worked at Baptist Hospital in Pensacola. Authorities say Vermillion jumped off a boat into the sound and never surfaced. Folks that live here on the coast of the Santa Rosa Sound say they saw search and rescue boats coming and going nearly all weekend long. One gentleman I spoke to says he actually practiced his medicine at Baptist Hospital. He says he wasn't aware Vermillion was the missing boater. He says although he didn't know him personally, it's still a tragic loss for the hospital community. Bryn Markey lives near Santa Rosa Sound. He says he was saddened when he heard the news. Yeah, you go to the water, have some fun, and then to not come back is a tragic. Reporting from Pensacola, Corey Pippen, Fox 10 News. Investigators are still looking into the circumstances surrounding Vermillion's death. We reached out to Baptist healthcare officials, but they declined to give an on camera interview. However, President and CEO Mark Faulkner did give us this statement. Carrie Vermillion's dedication to this organization and our community serves as a great example for what it means to be a remarkable person as well as a great leader. He was a dear friend and respected colleague. We ask the community to join the Baptist team in keeping Carrie's family in thoughts.